If you clicked on this video, you probably wonder what happened to Fearless. So in this video, I'll be going over theories about what happened to Fearless. Fearless was last seen on January 2nd, 2021, meaning he hasn't uploaded in over a year. And there are tons of theories on why Fearless doesn't upload anymore. However, this wasn't the first time Fearless would disappear, because Fearless would first disappear after this video called My Renegade Raider, which was posted on the 5th of October 2019. So which of the two being here, everyone was looking forward to a new Fearless video. But it sadly never came. Fearless would finally upload again on the 1st of February 2020, so because of this we could tell Fearless didn't really like the new chapter. But it would get worse after, because now Fearless wouldn't upload for 10 months straight, finally uploaded again on the 6th of December 2020. And little did we know this would be his last Fortnite video. Over time a lot of theories have been showing up about what happened to Fearless. However the first one is simple, because if we look at his old videos we can see it always involves defaults and noobs. Now as you guys know, nowadays it's hard to find noobs and defaults. This is simply because everyone gets better and there aren't a lot of new players. And this makes it hard for Fearless to make this type of content because it's basically impossible. Now another reason for Fearless to stop uploading would be because he doesn't like Fortnite anymore. Anymore. And I know this sounds weird, but if we go all the way back to first with old videos, we can see he has been playing Fortnite since the 26th of October 2017, which is nearly 5 years, and this makes him one of the OG players. And for people like him, who are used to the old Fortnite, the new Fortnite just isn't the same. Because so many OG Fortnite players have quit the game because it just became boring, or they got older, or they have no time because of school. And that brings me to the third reason. Now, if you've been watching Fearless for some time, you know that he said in one of his old Call of Duty videos that he dropped out of school. And if you drop out of school and want to go back after, it's really expensive. But if we look at Fearless's YouTube earnings, we can see he still makes around 2k a day without even uploading, but just imagine imagine how much money he made while uploading. Because for example a video like this where people watch all the way to the end can make you a hundred to two hundred thousand dollars. So with this money you could have gone back to college. Or not. Because as we all know Fearless's videos are super entertaining. And the longer the people watch the more money the creator gets. And if we go to his about section we can see he estimated roughly 1.5 billion views which in his case could equal up to 6 million dollars. So he might have just quit Fortnite and be in a sunset paradise right now. And saying Fearless only uploads when he needs money just doesn't make sense. Since as I said earlier he still makes around 2000 dollars every single day without even uploading. And for proof he doesn't just upload when he needs money, we need to go all the way back 4 years ago. Because as you can see, on October 26, 2017, he would upload his first Fortnite video and there's almost 2 months in between his first and second Fortnite video. Now this isn't as much as 2 years, but the point I'm trying to make is that Fearless would upload every time he got a new video that blew up. For example, if we look at the videos that he uploaded after, there's almost no time in between. Because these videos had way less views at the time they were uploaded. But maybe he just tries to stick with his unique upload schedule which consists of adding a few months between every upload. Because as you may have noticed, the time between each video keeps getting bigger. It started with a month, then 2, then 3, 4, 5 and so on. Fearless's last video was posted on the 2nd of January 2021, which is more than one and a half year ago, meaning he could return soon. With Fortnite adding the no building mode, it increases the chance of Fearless coming back because Sweats won't be able to build now. Some theories of Fearless getting sued has been showing up recently. These people claim Fearless has been sued by T-Pain, however this is untrue. Because first of all the music got cut out, meaning it never played, meaning it's impossible to get sued. Which was already impossible in the first place, and here's why. People who are not familiar with content creation might not know this, but if you use a copyright song, you can only get copyright claimed. Meaning all the money estimated from the video goes to the person who claimed the video. So you won't receive a strike nor get sued. And there's some people saying Fearless went to Twitch and he's now a famous Twitch YouTuber. But if you go to Fearless' socials and then to his Twitch, we can clearly see he was less live. 3 more years ago, so I guess he doesn't stream. But there's indeed a theory that might be true, which is Fearless is depressed. Now Fearless sounds pretty happy in his videos, right? Well 50% of depressed people act happy but really aren't, and most depressed people won't ever talk about their depression. And Fearless doesn't really use other social media, which makes it hard for us to know what's really going on in his life. But is Fearless dead? Well as I said in one of my other videos about Fearless, I checked his social blade and video count and noticed he had deleted 4 videos. And in one of his old videos I noticed he cut something out, which was today, so Fearless is not 
dead. And yet again, his upload schedule wasn't the best these past years. So all you hope now for is that Fearless likes chapter 3 and tries making content on it.